Live stream rage by moonlight. Let's play fun by daylight. Never running from a bad game. He is the one named Sailor Swood. He will never turn his back on a fan. He is always there to rage. He is the one on whom we can depend. He is the one named Sailor. Sailor Arnold. Sailor Druggy. Sailor Wah. Sailor Doctor. Losing subs thanks to this intro. He is the one named Sailor Swood. Live stream rage by moonlight. Let's play fun by daylight. With his center clones to help fight, he is the one named Sailor Swood. He is the one named Sailor Swood. He is the one Sailor Swood. Nailed it. Shoot. He comes from far away. From the depth of the darkness. He continues to wander. Soon, the void of the darkness is interrupted by something. The darkness is shown upon by the light. The light covers the darkness, and the darkness is no more. When the light and the darkness are one, the light makes light, and the dark makes darkness. I seek the darkness, and before long, He and I will become one. Thirtieth century, Crystal Tokyo. Astronomers of the thirtieth century have discovered a significant celestial object. Approaching Earth. It's determined to be a meteor of enormous size. Everyone watches in fear as the meteor continues on a collision course with Earth. And while all this is happening, An epidemic has begun to spread among the people of the city. Meanwhile, several youths have banded together to form a vicious gang. In search of answers, Neo Queen Serenity begins to pray to the legendary Mystic Silver. Crystal Genzushi. Why is the Genzusho vibrating so wildly? Evil energy has appeared.
It must be incredibly powerful. The Death Phantom has dealt a powerful blow. Huh? The, the Death Phantom is a new enemy? The era of the Great Peace is finally over. It was bound to happen sooner or later. This is a very serious matter. We must call upon the Sailor Senshi. Hey! Genzusho stopped vibrating. Strange. My visions of the disaster, too, have come to a stop. The ominous tremblings. What do they mean? Undoubtedly, this is in some way related to the comet. Could it be so? Yes, it must be so. The great peace of the universe must be protected using the power of the Ginzu Show. The new silver millennium must remain. Let's go. Older sister, are these the girls we're looking for? <laughs> Certainly, this is what we were sent here for. This must be where they live. Should I spy on them? It is our destiny. Yes, we must try to make Lord Ap Apsu's wish come true. It is destiny. Princess, I like my sister. That to make our destiny come true. Chibiusa, what is it? I just had a vision from the future. Yay! So what's it about? Was your boyfriend in it? It was about Momo-chan. Idiot. Yeah. 
It's more important than that. Usagi. It was about a new enemy. Some kind of aliens. We're all going to have to work together. We have to defeat them. That's pretty weird, Chibiusa. But still, the peace must continue interrupt uninterrupted. Even if aliens invade Earth. I am Sailor Moon. And on behalf of the moon, I'll punish you. Oh my god, that was 11 minutes. Hey everybody, it's LS11, and welcome to Pretty Soldier, Sailor Moon, another story. Moonlight, let's play fun by daylight, with his end close to help fight, he is the one named Sailor Swoop. Anyway, without any further ado, let's get the game underway. So, if you're just now joining me, or you sat through that 11 minutes of dialogue. Welcome either way. Usagi. Usagi, wake up. Mm. What's wrong, Luna? There's something peculiar about the town. I don't know what it is exactly, but there's something funny going on. Mm. Mm. Are you sure it isn't your imagination, Luna? No, there's something about the people as well. Hmm, okay. Be careful out there. Good night. W wait a second. Get up and go check it out. No, we're staying in bed. Hmm. Look, Usagi. Get up! Fine. I suppose I'd better be going now. Come on, Isagi. Ah, I just remembered. Remember to take along your diary. You got the diary. Use your diary to save the game. You can save everything you've done so far, but you can only save when you talk to a Luna P. Ball. Okay? Yes! Okay, let's go. So yes, what Luna's saying... As we now begin... Chapter 1, Her Destiny. What Luna the Talking Cat has just said, as we got the diary, is that if you go over here and talk to a Luna P ball, yes, you can save the game, and we will go down here and save the game. Just in case I lose this recording or something. So I probably owe some explanation about yesterday's episode. Episode Zero, for those of you who saw it. In it, I quote-unquote transformed and was wearing a Sailor Mars costume at the end of it. Uh, fun fact, this video is being recorded immediately after that, so there is a 5% chance I might still be wearing it. <laughs> I'm kidding. Anyway. But that was just to make people laugh. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hmm.
seem to have lost my way. Oh? You look pretty tired. This medicine should recover your health. There's always lots of tired people. Now where's the exit? Me too, friend. Me too. We can go back inside Usagi's house. So yes, this is an RPG based on the old anime Sailor Moon. And I have chosen to play it for some reason. I'm not really sure why. There's Usagi's mom. There, oh wait, I was hitting the wrong button. Oh, Usagi, you're up early today. That's all. You can apparently hold B to run. But I really still don't see the way out of here. Oh, like that. Is that, um... If you want to learn more about how to play this game, then you should go to the clock shop and the game center. We're not going to do that, because I am an intelligent human. I believe, anyway. I don't know where I'm going. Usagi, let's investigate the rest of our neighborhood first. I really don't know what to do. I played the first 20 minutes of this game... This is Coca-Cola on it. That's product placement right there. Um, oh wait, here we go, maybe. The icons on the wall are common commands available in battle. Stand in front of each one and press the A button. A short description of the command will then appear. Oh, this is the clock shop, so that's not where we want to go. Yeah, I played the first 20 minutes of this game. Wait, here we go, plot time. Somebody help! Ah! It's Naru! Naru's being attacked by that daemon! Usagi, transform into Sailor Moon! Moon Cosmic Power! Make up! Hold it right there. Who's there? For love and justice, I am the su sailor suited pretty soldier Sailor Moon. Listen up, you daemon who attacks helpless girls. I, Sailor Moon, in the name of the moon, will punish you. What an pundits. Here we go. Only almost 20 minutes in. Oh. Hey, so I get 13 damage. That's not bad. Alright, Moon TR action. Hey, we did it. Oh. That's kind of cute. A daemon's come back to life. So, this is what you were talking about, Luna. Thank you, Sailor Moon. It's alright now. If you're ever in danger again, just call for me. I just happen to have the same phone number as your best friend Usagi, don't worry about it. I think you can talk to her as well. Thank you, Sailor Moon, from the bottom of my heart. That's all. That's all you can really talk about. That's it. <sighs> I think I'll go back home and take a nap. Where am I? Master. That voice I just heard now was... You're, you're Kunzai! Master. Destiny draws near. An evil comet is approaching from an evil star to return destiny to its origins. 
a horrible comet, the power to return everything, now, in the future, and in the past. It is giving birth to an existence in which all shall be returned to what has been. What? Returning destiny? When will this happen? This is from the distant future. Do I have something to do with it now? You shall choose which future. Wait! Kunzai! Was that a dream? But I get to choose which future. The shit. The shite no. No Hako is glimmering. Hey everyone, listen up! Hey everybody, transform! Demons have appeared again. I wonder what in the world has happened. Have the Death Busters been revived? Usagi? Are you sure you didn't dream that? Oh, you're so mean, Ray. Ami believes me, right? Huh? Where's Ami? Sorry, I came as fast as I could. I just talked with the... Ur... Ur... Urawa? Yeah. Urawa. Anyway, let's go inside. Hmm. It's been a long time since you've met with Ura... Urawa, huh? He came to Tokyo for, the, for his holidays. So where have you decided to go with Urawa? Um, well... There's some national exams coming up. So you see... See what? I thought we'd go to the library. Eh, wanna go to the library with him? Oh, really? Honey, you could just tell me if you want. Ah, you're sneaky, Mako. So what are the date plans you guys have after that? Huh? It, it, it's not like that. We can't date. We're all still in junior high. But one day I'll be right for you, Irawa. Yes. Yeah. So where are you going? Hi. Sorry for making you all wait. What's wrong, Ami? Your face is all red. Hey, Ami's got a boyfriend. And he's coming here soon. Wait, wait a second, Mako. It's not like that with Urawa. Ah, oh, hi, everyone. How are you? It's me before I cut my hair. Ray, you look better than ever today. Thank you, Yuichiro. Take it easy, everyone. So, Ray. What, what was that, you soggy? Why are you talking with that tone of voice? Because of what just happened. You and Yuichiro are great friends, right? Back off, she's taken. It, it, it's nothing. Really? 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 It's nothing. Well then, Usagi, who's your boyfriend? Huh? Me? It's mom. It's Mamo and I. We're the perfect couple. We'll be like this forever. He's kissed me already. Ah! I shouldn't have said that. Thanks for that. <sighs> Even when you act like that, I'm still jealous. True. Usagi's with Mama, Mamaru. Ami and Urawa might be a bit separated, but they're a couple. And it doesn't matter what Rei says, she's with Yuichiro. <sighs> I want a boyfriend too. Me too. <sighs> Don't you have to go already, Ami? Oh yeah. Sorry about today, everyone. Hey, do you want to follow her? Huh? That's really mean. But, I really want to know. But wait a sec, everyone. Okay, let's go. Yay! Huh? Mako, aren't you coming? Uh, no, I stand firm on this. I'm really worried about her. 
Oh, okay, just this once. It's been so long since I've met Uro. Uroa. Uroa? Uroa sounds more right. More correct. Oh. Ami got on that bus, right? That bus goes to Tokyo Station, doesn't it? Let's go on the bus, too. I'm so excited! So yeah, now we actually have uh, the other four, or the other three in our party. Wait, that's what we're supposed to do. Like a series of Glory G. Ah! Ami's right there! Usagi, hide! Nailed it. Hey, Usagi, let's just wait a little bit longer, okay? Even if she acts like that, those two are really close. I wonder how Urala is. I wonder how far those two have gotten. It's been such a long time. I hope Urala is alright. Looks like the bullet train's arrived. Those two must be having a wonderful reunion. Yeah? Hmm. Doesn't something seem funny? Ah! Wait a second, what's happened? Th there's a monster in there! Get out of the way! Monster? The monster trapped a boy in there. Get the police! Everyone, let's go check it out. Well, obviously, it's an RPG. We gotta check. We gotta go check it out. Ami, everyone, you come to help. Huh? I can feel so many different auras. Everyone, transform. Mercury star power. Mars star power. Jupiter star power. Venus star power. Moon cosmic power. Let's go in. So yeah, now we've got all the, uh, we've got all the guardians. Well, all the interplanetary guardians, at least. How do we go in? We could save right now, but we'll save later. This is gonna be the last bit of the episode. I'm gonna have to edit some of it out. Here we go. Yeah, so, uh, we can do Supreme Thunder. Which we'll do Supreme Thunder, because... Fire Soul, Moon Tiara Action, Sabo Spray Freezing, and Crescent Beam, because we don't have Venus Love Me Chain yet. Sabo Spray Freezing! Moon Tiara Action, Fire Soul! Oh, this is such a cute little sound bite. Let's see, I guess we're just going to have to do regular attacks now. Because no one has the, uh, the MP. Hey, we did it there. Yay, look at them! Hey, everyone leveled up! We did it. Oh, we got another battle. This sailor shoot attack. Ooh, 
Ooh, Fire Soul Bird, what's that? No. Moon Spiral Heart Attack. Shine Aqua Illusion, that's the one of hers I do know, and Venus Love Me Chain. No, oh, I love the little sound bites. Did it in two moves, nice. Wow, and everyone leveled up again. Guys, it's like I'm playing Final Fantasy, starring Sailor Moon. Uroa! Are you alright, Uroa? It needs you now. Uroa! Hang in there. Just hang on. It's okay. He's only unconscious. Hey, Uma. Surely Queen Beryl has been revived. Anyway, let's get back to the Hikawa Shrine. Are you alright? Yes, I'm alright now. Well, Mizuna. I had a vision in my dream. The past and future changed places. What? I don't understand it very well, but... History. No destiny will change. Destiny? So the future has already been replaced? No. The past has also been replaced. The past? Ha! Katsu! That's... who is that? An enemy? My name is Sin. This is merely a greeting. <laughs> I'm all covered in soot. What was that? I don't know. <coughs> hey, Ray, your face is pitch black. Oh, shut up. <coughs> Ray, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. My clothes are all dirty. I'm going to take a bath. <clears throat> Sin, hmm? That's what it said. Who is it? A new enemy? Ray, telephone, it's Hurika. Ah, I'll take the call for her. Do we have a save point nearby? Nope. Where's the phone? Oh wait, here we go. Here we go. So we're gonna save now. So, I know we're only on chapter one still, but it's already been 30 minutes, so thank you all for watching this episode of Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon, another story. If you liked the video, leave me a like. Tell me in the comments down below what you think of the series so far. And until next time, everybody. Oh. Tell me in the comments down below what you think of this so far. And don't forget to subscribe. It's free. It's easy. It really helps me out. And the more subscribers we get, the more encouraged I am to do stupid stuff, like wear a Sailor Moon costume. So, by the way, see you guys.